Hey there everyone, this is Alcal playing Crash Core. I hope the game behaves more better than yesterday, I don't know. Alright, so here's Mars. Hey there everyone, this is Alcal. So like I said, today we might beat the game, but we might also not, and it will entirely depend on this level. That's the level I was remembering. Like I said, you know, there's one of them I remember being pretty challenging. It's absolutely this one, because you gotta fly around. The Pac-Man bulldozers have escaped their ethereal prison. And then, meanwhile, I'm trying to... Oh, no, that's not... How do you... This? This is, this is how I change my camera sometimes. I don't know what I'm doing. That was a pretty poor jump. And yeah, the bulldozers kill you. You know, like if we were in a maze. Uh, as Try one does. For size. And it, wow, it crashed immediately. It's a pretty good start. I hope this I works. feel like it happens when I press a button while I'm on this screen. So maybe if I just make sure not to press anything, things are gonna be okay. Like it's pretty random, but like I mean, something's causing that. Whoosh. So, where are we at now? I don't... Like, how do you get those ones that are, like, way up there? Well, that's not how you get that. I died the exact same way I did last time. It's pretty good. Mission fails. No, it just crashed immediately. So, I just put a save state. So, if maybe... If it, if it, if it breaks once again... I can just, like, reload and it'll work. I guess we'll find out. How do you get those, like, really high ones? Well, there I went over that, somehow. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, we're just going to be flaming ourselves our way around. How did I miss you? Alright, this is uh, not the best going run, but you know what? We're learning. Yeah, that's right, we're skidding somehow on nothing. So yeah, so like, hmm. So yeah, so like, hmm, indeed. Then we get a nice smoke trail. I don't know what's going on with my truck, and then I die. Mission fail. We come back, Try this for and size. it breaks. Try this for size. Okay, so reloading, and I just get back here like that. Try this I can't some. reload because whatever broke stays broken. What do you have missed? Oh jeez. Show us what you've and got. This time it broke. Dang it. Ah, didn't see it. Wow, it actually broke in the thing. Ah, uh, this is a problem. Try this for size. Good luck. that I don't know how I didn't get hurt there <laughs> Okay. 
do that, but better. Right, relax a little bit. Alright, one more. One that's on top there. Okay, I think my does that. Like go over here and ramp off of here with the big jump. Uh, I guess that wasn't a good enough jump. So I think the problem is that I just didn't spend enough time like on on the floor while accelerating. So that's not gonna work. Oh! Mm -mm. See, that, weirdly enough, gives me the height. But like, then I need a distance, too. Oh, 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 oh! Yeah! Okay! Alright, a quiet victory here, as I was just kind of pensively going through the thing, and I beat the record by far. And now it's Neptune! We're skipping a few planets between Mars. I guess we're skipping the gas planet to go into another gas planet. Um... Hopefully this world is a little more stable. It's just a race. You are forced into the dump truck. And it's a big old loop, it has spikes and invisible walls. Drive around the shape and don't hit the columns if you want. Oh, cow, why aren't you changing your camera angle? Because I want to be changing it all the time. Like, if I had a way to just have it always behind me, I would do that without any thoughts, but... I'm pretty sure the gravity would be higher on a gas giant like Neptune, and not like the floatiest ones yet. But I'm not an astrophysicist, so I could be wrong. I doubt it, but I could be wrong. Fly off into a groove, then eat your weight in pistachios. What a strange thing to say, well I'll say it again here anyway. I forget what it was I said, though. There's nothing about pistachios. That makes sense. This is what Neptune looks like. Like, once you dig into the cloud cover, oh yeah, it's all, uh, it's all green and blue rocks. Everyone knows that, especially Alan Grant, the fictional character from Jurassic Park. Everyone's favorite part. Alright, check that out. Whoosh. I think that's his name, I actually don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Where did I get that name from then? I don't know, that was my winning run. The one run was the winning Well, I don't know if I got gold. I got gold. It was, could have been closer. I did it! I beat the- There were only two levels left? I thought there was more. I mean, I couldn't remember what it would have been, but I figured I just forgot, you know? The increasingly farcical interplanetary challenge. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Their success and yours couldn't be more complete, they say, before unveiling the next step of the game that I'm not gonna do. So, missile clearance time bonus! What's with these medals? I don't know. All of that just happened, and I'm an uncontrollable madman. That's probably accurate. What? Oh no! Now do it faster! <laughs> so, we entered a time trial part of the game. What does that mean? Argent Tower, I'm not even scored on? How? So, as you can see, every level have lost their... well, some of them lost their metal. Some of them have changed into platinum metal. So what does that mean? Basically, the game challenges you to beat every level again under a new platinum thing. 
And, uh, yeah, that's basically what there is to it. I'm just kind of looking around real quick. Okay, that's the shuttle. And I don't plan on doing Platinums. That is by far the hardest part of the game. It's just replaying the same levels we now know, except, you know, be more faster, be more efficient, and all that. And that's fine, honestly, but it's not what I want to do. When I am, I am bothered, though, by these two levels that do not have any... Uh, medals. So that's gonna be my last action in the game. Just making sure everything is okay everywhere. There's nothing else. I'm fascinated that I got that. So yeah, it's just Outline Farm and uh, this one that I have absolutely no medal. Alright, cool. Yesterday one. Yeah, so every time got lower. Try this for size. You can do this. So this is the first one of these. By of these, I mean truck level. Got it. Oh, and you get a counter for uh, destroying buildings now. So, you know, things that are a little bit different. I mean, yeah, the, the hot dog is there. But it is not the, the focus anymore. Oh, jeez, this is bad. Probably. So a lot of the levels that I remember being nightmare was, uh, was probably levels I replayed here in time trial and like trying to get all of goals. I'm going to guess. Which you know what? Fair enough. But it is actually like pretty hard. Like it is genuinely one of the hardest things in video games, probably. Well, okay, I don't know about that. But, you know, from a, a, a physical video game you could buy, like, it is up there. Uh, yeah, because see, look at that. Like, I, geez, I started my swerve very badly. I'm probably gonna lose. And you know what? I accept that I'm gonna lose a few times, possibly. Can I just nudge it? Can I just nudge it? Yeah! <laughs> sure, game, let me get away with that. It's just a bronze, I, I don't care though. Like, I just don't want to have a blank. A blank feels so bad. All right, the other one was here. Outland Farm, another dump truck level. Shocking. Try this for size. I hope this works. Oh, it's this one. like drive into the gas canister well maybe it didn't have any effect at all Multi-spin, though, was really pretty. Alright, now for the morning silo. Can I just nudge it to death? I think I might be able to just nudge it to death. Three. Yeah! <laughs> like, that is clearly not the intention, but man, whatever works, works. See, this is why it's okay if I destroy, like, the entire universe. Everything just gets rebuilt. Alright, and now I'm pretty sure I have a medal on every spot, except for the 
No, there's one way up here. Yeah, that's uh, the space level. And, you know, that doesn't count. Yeah, it's just Shuttle Island. That, like, there's no medals to gain. And uh, there you go. And with that, remember that I played this game out of sheer nostalgia. And I've done it. I've satiated my nostalgia. I did what I want to do. And I am incredibly happy I did. So coming up next, in case you're not a Patreon, which is the vast majority of viewers, <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I'm not saying that as a critic. I, it's just, look, whatever. Um, I'm going to be changing something in the future where there's not going to be a discrete R zone, but instead it's like there's going to be the R zone equivalent, but everything's going to flow into three, the three slots. It's, instead of having an R zone slot, there's just going to be an R zone pick amongst the flow of games I get played. This will start after the next game I'm going to be playing. Uh, like there, I, there was a Patreon request that I got uh, late. They were late, but I told them, you know what? Just go ahead and give me your your, your picks. I'll choose from them anyways. I'll fit them in, you know, when, when when I feel like is the right time. And I'm going to do that right now, next time. Uh, yeah, so just you know that now. <laughs>